Feel good? Do I look cool? <laughs> Flexible working, whether here in the office, whether at home, on the road, in a coffee shop, this is something that we've always championed here at Journey Further and over the past four or five months, thanks to COVID-19, this is something that everybody across the globe has had to get on board with. And it does and has offered some really interesting challenges that we've all had to overcome, but that has not stopped the Good Work Slack channel from blowing up week after week over the past few months with some incredible results from our clients. And that is what I wanna find out all about in today's vlog. Let's go. Hello John, uh, first and foremost, how have you been finding remote working? I think I've done some of my best work from home. I really mm. do. But where I've particularly selfishly benefited is that I've been able to entirely control my environment, right? And so I can I can do stuff which I would absolutely never do in an office. Like I can have music blaring and I can just really get in the zone and, and deliver. I think actually it's not a handicap, it's a thing that can, well, it has turned out great work, right? So. And speaking of good work, I know you've been doing some amazing stuff for Awesome Merch. Why don't you tell us a little bit more about that? We, we ran a test um, which was specifically targeted at mobile users and it was about uh, reducing the amount of real estate that the page header takes on every page. So, so we would have more real estate for products and other useful information, the reason people come to a site. So we ran that for a period of, I think, four weeks. And overall, it turned around uh, a 15% improvement. So Andy, you've had a busy day. Uh, yeah, busy day, but very good, very productive. Um, had a discovery session with a new client this morning. Uh, the discovery sessions are an opportunity for us to just get under the hood a little bit, ask the questions which I would like to think most agencies probably don't ask. And that was some of the feedback we got today actually was not only do other people not ask it of them, they don't ask it themselves either. I'm alright, I think that it's quite interesting that you will be working alongside them even closer than everyone else. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're doing, um, we're doing a secondment, exactly the kind of thing I came to Journey Further to do in my previous roles, working both agency side and client side. I knew there was like a disconnect in the way those companies work together. And this kind of thing, which is where I would go in um, two and a half days a week, actually working with the client in their office, spending time with them. And I think that's the way business should be done these days, is a lot of businesses are seeing the value in what businesses can bring in some capacity it might not be as a full service agency you know it could be a three month contract it could be a 12 month contract enough for them to find their feet send them in the right direction and off they go we've got some big big ambitious goals um, but feeling confident will help them hit it so at the beginning of lockdown we started quite a big website migration project so working on it is Steve in London, there's um, me, Jess, Dan and uh, Lucy in Leeds. Because we, we do working from home anyway, we're used to running through stuff on Hangouts, we've got Slack, you know, that's our main comms method anyway. So running a project like that just meant that we were already set up to, to deal with it. Um, but we also brought in things like um, additional project management tools. So we've used something called Asana, which from my perspective, because I was managing the project as a whole, being able to assign tasks to people and brief them in on an individual elements and, and just sort of check where everything is, has been really useful. All these tools just come together um, and allow us to, to manage projects and, and deliver great results. Yeah. Billy, how are you doing? Heading out for a walk. I feel like you're going to follow me because you've got that you've got that look in your eyes and a camera in your hand. Remote working is made a lot easier when you've got all the right gear. I know that we've gone one step further. Over the last few weeks, we've taken the decision to like introduce a working from home allowance, which is just basically £100, we're saying, for everyone to basically kit out their home working space. And the reason we've done that, really, obviously working from home has taken a bit more focus in the last few months. And not everyone's as lucky as everyone else in terms of their home setup. And we just really wanted to help out with that. So we've opened up this allowance for people to just either get some something really practical to help them work at home, or even if they're just missing some of the kind of comforts of the office, like a coffee machine, for example, um, we're sort of saying, get whatever you want that's gonna make that a more comfortable space to work from to do some better work. And the more we can take any of the home working worries away, 
which mm. might be the lack of a second monitor. I don't have a good enough chair. Like I mentioned, the coffee machine. I don't have good enough coffee at home. If we can help with that, we can really get people to focus you know, on what they're at home for, which is to be happy, do some great work. It's like getting a present for Christmas. <laughs>